On a breaking news overnight in the Massachusetts primary, there is a projected winner in the contentious race for Suffolk County District Attorney. But one candidate is not conceding just yet. Our team coverage begins with Anna Myler. She is live in Boston this morning. Anna? That's right, Kate. Ricardo Arroyo is not conceding, but shortly after the Associated Press called the race for Kevin Hayden, he declared victory in the Democratic primary and made promises about what he will do as Suffolk County DA. With today's decision by the voters, we're going to do a whole lot more. A whole lot more community engagement. A whole lot more juvenile diversion. More with illegal gun targeting and more with safety, safety neighborhood initiatives. With 94% of precincts reporting, Hayden has just under 5,000 more votes than Boston City Councilor Ricardo Arroyo. Governor Baker appointed Hayden to DA earlier this year, and now he will likely serve a full term as the top law enforcement official in yes. Suffolk County. In the weeks leading up to this election, Arroyo's campaign was full of controversy as old allegations of sexual assault surfaced. He lost several important endorsements as a result. That this last two weeks has been incredibly difficult because of the subject matter and the things that have come out in the last two weeks. That I know that there is work to be done in society to deal with those things, and I will always be at the front of that fight. Again, Arroyo is not conceding, saying there are more votes that need to be counted, but with 94% of precincts reporting and no Republican candidate in the general election, Hayden has a clear path to become DA for Suffolk County. Live in Boston, Anna Myler, WBZ This Morning.